Welcome back to Self Principle. As always, I'm Dr. Sean Hashmi. Now, we all know that plant-based diets are good for us for a number of reasons. We've talked about kidney disease, heart disease. Now, there's an interesting study coming out that's talking about what is the role of plant-based diets in breast cancer. So let's look at the data. This was really looking at, once again, population data among 65,574 postmenopausal women in France. And the question they asked was, what happens if you have very good adherence either to a healthy plant-based diet or an unhealthy plant-based diet? So let's look at how they define each one. A healthy plant-based diet was defined as something that contained whole grains, fruits, vegetables, nuts, legumes, vegetable oils, and my favorite, tea or coffee. On the other hand, an unhealthy plant-based diet was something that contained more fruit juices, refined grains, potatoes, sugar-sweetened beverages, and desserts. Now, what's interesting is, is in both of these arms, a little bit of meat was okay. So, what did they find? Well, the greatest adherence to a healthy plant-based diet, not surprisingly, lowered the risk of breast cancer by about 14%. On the flip side, the greatest adherence to an unhealthy plant-based diet actually increased the risk of breast cancer by about 20%. So the author said one of the mechanisms they thought possibly could be because healthy plant-based diets are rich in fiber. Fiber, as you know, can reduce the circulating estrogen levels. It can also increase sex hormone binding globulin. And there's all these wonderful polyphenols in whole foods that may actually improve the gut microbiome, may improve insulin sensitivity, and overall reduce cancer risk. So what's the bottom line here? If you're thinking about eating a plant-based diet, don't fall into the hype of looking at all sorts of processed foods that say plant-based on there. Be very, very careful. A lot of the new artificial products, the nuggets, the meats, and so forth, they're loaded with saturated fat, salt, and all sorts of processing that occurs. There's nothing as good as good old strawberries, good old fruits and vegetables that are nature's best food intended for you. Thanks so much for watching. As always, if you got a question, you got a topic you want to know about, send me an email, selfprincipal at gmail.com. I'll see you next time.